just had a message come through. So, where we're going, she said the kettle's on. <laughs> I've just had a drink before we come out. And me. We'll have one Mind halfway you, it's not through. just blooming. It's not just tea and coffee, is it? It's all the biscuits they're going to have and all the bloody lovely oh, what, cakes. What did they have last time? I'm trying to cut White down. chocolate and raspberry cookies. I know. I'm trying to cut down. Well, I only had Look one. Look at that over there. That looks like... Cloud. Well, it looks like clouds on the top of... Uh, on the top of, like, Sierra Mountains or something. But it's just it's not. It's just clouds. Well, I hope it's the weather's like this when you go to the Isle of Man. Oh, yes, we're off to the TT. You're leaving uh, me. No, it's not the TT race, is it? Manx. It's the Manx Grand Prix. August. Me and Dan having a little break, Tanya. A little break on our bikes. Well, guess what? what? I'll be having a little break at home. <laughs> I can watch yes. what I want, put the telly on what I want, Tanya. go to bed guess when I what? want. You do anyway. So. <laughs> That'll be, that'll be no different. Uh, what it's, I will it, say very quickly, go on. Isle of Man, we're going on the 24th of August for four nights. Um, so me and Dan are going, we'll probably, the, the, there'll probably be someone in the Isle of Man who'll want to visit from us. If they've got a little issue with the horse, want some advice. But we're struggling, we can get the ferries with the bikes. We're struggling for accommodation. So if anybody who watches this video knows of anywhere, we're not that bothered where it is in the Isle of Man. I used to like going to Douglas, the main town, but it doesn't matter now. I think, I think they've got nice pubs anywhere for us to have a meal and things. So yeah, guys, if you know of anybody, Isle of Man, Airbnb 24th of August, bed and breakfast. anything, <laughs> um, then me and Dan uh, uh, would appreciate it. And, and let us know, drop a message. Tanya. If you want to visit on a horse. Yeah, as well, yeah. So, while I haven't got the horse with me, I can put these on. But I don't usually wear sunglasses when I'm working the horse. Okay, here we go. This is a... Uh, the owner, Michelle, picked this trailer up yesterday. It's in there. Uh, <laughs> uh, so they picked this up yesterday. This is a horse with a history of wanting to rush out of a trailer. Uh, Michelle's worked hard on taking the horse in and out of a lorry, but she just picked this up yesterday. So we're going to have a little look now and see if we can load her horse up and see how it reacts to the panels being shut. Uh, I have no idea. Mm. We're going to try it without the shavings first because this is all black, look. So yeah, this is all black, so we'll try it first else that, or else there's going to be shavings all over the school I know I know it is so we've got the feed coming up now it's enough so you just got it I literally just got it yes wow so you're gonna tie to this you're gonna tie to this now you know if she panics out of here she could really hurt herself that's chain that is so I would have you got any of those ties um I've got um, a head collar that um do you understand what I'm saying here? If she yeah. panics out, you're gonna lo you could lose your horse because she will just want to get out. Yeah. If she's got a history of that panicking, yeah. There's no give to that. You see, this will just break, or won't break. So this could do with having one of our clips on. I don't know. I don't know. We're gonna look, or we'll have to borrow one off somebody in there because you understand what I'm saying. You're gonna lose your horse seriously. Yeah. Yeah. She'll go down and she'll break her neck. So we need that there. That if she did panic, yeah, enough that that's gonna gonna go okay so i'm happy with with this that's all right now she can flop that around it ain't gonna come off yeah yeah you happy with that yeah absolutely this in case i need to get out yeah uh well i can just push that down if i needed to so that's right yeah sure yeah it's your that's it you got to think of that right what, um, i couldn't remember which one it was and it is this <laughs> Ma mara who's this now mara who are you working today you gonna see whether we can go in uh, the new the new uh, trailer oh, but i just said i couldn't is, remember how big she one, was i don't know if you put it the clip in but i was videoing her last week snoring let oh really snoring well this is to stop this is to this is to stop <laughs> no it, it was really 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 noisy so we're trying to stop the rattling if we can <laughs> mm -hmm. 
so usually I would put some shavings in here but this is black so we're gonna see how we get on with it as it is we may have to move the whole rig down the bottom there and put shavings on because we don't want shavings going all in the school so uh, we, we're pretty much ready now if you have a look Bab I've got an escape route here because remember this horse can panic when it's in I can get out of that door we've put a lick and so a little bit of feed there for when the horse comes in I've just put this wedge in there so it's a lot less it was really shaking noisy we just put a wedge in there uh, so I think we're not far off. Okay, I'm wondering if the feed should have been here. Because that, if the feed's this side, she'll want to turn the hind quarter. Ah, right. Move, move the feed. You with what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, do you agree with that? What, I, what I'm saying is, oh, these trailers that travel backwards, it's hind quarters to their... Uh, right, I was okay. So let's see. I've put the feed on the left, okay. on the left, okay, on the left. She's quite a lump. It's quite a lump, isn't she? Quite a lump. Well done. Now this is the first time Michelle has offered this to to the horse. Was it Lara or Cara? What was it? What's the horse's name? Mara. Mara. I was nearly there with Cara. <laughs> Good one. And then there's a feed there. Do you know what, girl? You could have a job with me anytime. Seriously. How about that? What a great first experience. Now, when you come out, right, when you come out, I want you to look down and give her space to get out if she needs to on a loose rein. So when you come out now, look down at the ramp. Look down. Don't try and hold her. Look down. No, no. Right, take for a walk around. Take for a walk around. Well done. I love the way you were quiet, went to the ramp and waited. It was very good, wasn't it? Creep out slowly, but but can you just stop there a minute? Yeah. When you do it, look, you've got to give her a way out if she wanted to panic out. So look, you're here. When you come out, you have to move back. So you're not going to go flying. I've seen people get just wiped out. Because if you're here and she gets out, she can only go with her shoulders this way. So when you're ready, you move back on a loose track and you look down and you come down with her. Is that all right? Okay. Yeah, I think that was a perfect. Yeah, off you go again. I love the fact that she went straight over with her hindquarters. And then, now give her a rub. And be aware that if she came out, she's going to come through you. You've got to put your left hand up to block if need. That's it. That's it. Yeah, block towards her eye with a wave in motion if she comes. Yeah? And we're just leaving there a little while now. Block it towards her eye with a wave in motion. Up oh, right there. Now stop when she goes in there. But it's a wave in motion and rubber always rubber neck. Right. Let let wave in motion. Okay, straight back in there because she decided to come out. So you didn't bring her out. You take her straight back up there. Look at her hindquarters. Okay. That's it. And then just, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, back in one more time. Hmm? Okay, so, okay. Okay. Right. This is why we need this, uh, we need the thing to go across the string, you know? Yeah. So I'll give this a go. All right. You gotta try and watch me now. Like I'm touching, I just let a bump into my, and then rubber. You don't wanna turn it round. See how I'm, she's gonna bump into my hand here. Yeah. On, back round there. If she decides to come. Now I'm gonna let her come now. Guys, did you hear that crack? If you look now at the rear uh, right foot, as it lands here, it totally breaks the trailer door and you can hear it. Right, there. that's the first that's nightmare you've got. Whoa. That's how heavy she is. Your ramp's just gone. Can someone hold, hold her a minute? Ramp's just gone. It's because she's probably heavier than anything else been in there. Yeah. Oh, shit. Turn have a look at this. The thing is, right, can I just say, girls, get a second, just so I can show you. Right, now I've, I've done this. I wouldn't pat her too hard. Not, when I've left town, you can't. Uh, we don't want to be in jumping there with patting, that's all. So around a trailer, because she can she can have a habit of just, so rather than pat on her, we'll, we'll just smooth around the trailer. Right, what's just happened there? Now, I have been to jobs where that's happened on the bottom step yeah. and carried on and it's gone further up. Guaranteed, if it goes here and a foot goes in, yeah. you will never get near this again. No, I've seen it, Sam. I've seen it where... We carried on because it it can sometimes rot more on the ends, yeah. which is what's happened here. But if she goes in here, and it happens here, yeah. her legs going through, yeah. you won't get nowhere near your box. Um, look, we're all geared up to get this done, but I ain't risking losing your horse. Yeah, don't mind. Uh, so I I come back, I come back. Yeah. She's just had a great experience with yeah. me. Because what the f last thing they do is the first thing they learn. Yeah. She has just gone in, had a little bit of grub in there. She yeah. came out on a loose rein yeah. quietly. She, so it doesn't matter. No. If it were, we're ending it on a good note. I'd have been, I'd note. have been devastated for you if it yeah. would have been a bad note. Like yeah. you ended up her taking you out. Yeah. But I've got to, you've got to learn that has to block her jaw. Yeah. And your fingers around by the eyes. You don't hit into the eyes. But she's got to know there's a barrier there. Yeah. You were waving and she knows. That was a bluff. Like that, yeah. Like that. This. Yeah. Okay. okay. She's got to know. She hasn't been blocked. So you got to block her. So th what the process is, if this is safe, yeah. we, I would have done that maybe, maybe 10 times yeah. to where she's settling more. Yeah. Okay. And not needing to come out so quick. Then we would have changed it to, to close one of these. Yeah. So the first one would have been somewhere, someone here. To close it to here but keep out the way because if she comes out you're gone yeah. so that's what we do we do one and then i keep her here with that shut let her settle for a bit that opens bring her out so when we're good at that then we shut the two then we have to clip on and we have to leave her yeah. she'll go through a few emotions and when she settles we bring her out so you know what we're going to do next time yeah, yeah, yeah. that get that done it's life it's life she's been to several but i have sit 
I've seen it where, fortunately, the horse wasn't really that badly damaged, but it went through here, and then it just frightened life out of the horse. Then the horse becomes that frightened of the ramp. Oh, exactly. Yeah, so that, yeah. Yeah, look at that. This is, this is gone. Yeah, that's gone. Yeah, I'm just saying. I can't make it no worse. Uh, It was a great experience. Huh? Great experience for that horse then. It's really good. There's your back up. Disengagement. Can you disengage? You yeah, disengage. Take the and up with your hand. There's a disengage, yeah. Good. And then the other way. Try and lift the other hand though. That that's it. Yeah, so the back end's going around, that's good, yes, and then walk out of it. Sometimes when they do it nice, just go. If you walk forward and stop, how does that work? Um, can you back her up from here without moving first? Like, don't move your feet. Yeah, stop. Yeah. Right, get her attention. Okay, wave it. Oh my life. That other foot, that other foot, look, I've looked at it. Yeah. It's gone. She's got rid of the stick. Now I'm going to ask, oh. Huh? No I'm going to tut and bump a little. Oh, look at that. Right, so if you can, I'll oh, tell her how good she is. Tell her how good she is. Hey, girl. Hey. Mara. <laughs> Mara. Um, so. I'll leave this now. I'm going to look at that foot. I think it will be the front left. I'm going to tuck, elevate myself, and then stop. Okay? This is all to do with her stopping a bit better. She's kind of walking through you. And the thing is, if that happens, your space in the trailer, you want it to mean yeah. quite a lot. So see whether you can send that foot back. Then stand here. This is something you can practice. You're going to tuck. You're not going to go forward with the feet. Right? Ask first. Tut. And then this rock. Duh. So go in front of her, and then I want you to stop. I want you to just stop. Stop. Okay. Not bad. Would you agree? Yeah. That felt quite good. Okay. Now I want you to stand here, and don't move your feet. Send a foot back. Use the other hand. Yeah. This hand. Yeah. The stop. Good time. And then now the other foot. Look at it. Yeah. Lovely. That's good. Really think that was quite good. Huh? Uh, right, so walk again and... <laughs> right, ready? Watch my foot. See that? Tell her how good she is. I'll even... Have you done any of this low in the head? I can't remember. We did some... Yes. So that was a little... Try... A little squeeze here, and Im immediately both go. Oh, lovely. Now, I would do that around the trailer quite a bit, so she gets cool around the trailer. Release for each foot, and we'll do this again. So, so I'm just merrily walking along. Merrily walking along, she'll be wanting to go back there, and I'm just gonna done. Okay, so if she kind of walks into your past, then you use this hand, bump her back, or remember if you carry a little stick, tuck first, wave, nothing, then just bump the stick, keep bumping it, so it means something. Eventually, it'll just be a wave. There. Yes. Okay. Got to get this space thing sorted. Okay. So do you want to try that? If I bring her to here and then you take over. And then when you're ready, shug your shoulders down. Now look back and but, and, and get her back. Because it, it's not immediate like with me, is it? Use that hand to snap down. Yes. Go back again. And it doesn't matter how many times she doesn't do it for you. 
you keep going till she does it good so she has to work out what she did right a little bit more life go on and then and when you stop stop oh that was better give a little rub that was better that was immediate wasn't it that's what i'm looking for not bad yeah, that's that's a, that, that wasn't too bad right we'll leave it at that with that one because we've got other things to do but you got to work on that you don't want to creep in past you in your space i'd be really 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 big on that i am okay because i'm just thinking of in there keep your mom safe for her there's not really anyone really in charge it's the way it is it's a partnership but you've maybe got to come step up a little bit so she feels confident with you in there if you're holding a hand through it and not coming over you because she was about to come through you a bit there. You felt it, didn't you? Yeah, and that's, you know, but whatever happens, when we get to it, you've got to remember, you've got to move out the way and give her room when you're about to come out because if she did, something moved and she wanted to go fast, you're in a way. When you're ready, you get out and give her a, a way out. Okay, so, that, so that's all right. I'll do the other side. I'll lift my hand. Lovely. Lovely. Right, okay. So, that's okay. So, we'll go. I'm coming. But remember... So round here, I still need to stop. Tell her how good she is. Okay. But then, because I'm in front, I got a bit of a stop, a bit of a backup. That tuck works well with it, doesn't it? Okay, so I'm neutral, this means nothing. No, I'm not. That's feet forward. So I'm gone. I'm gone. Stop. Tell her how good she is. Now I find these ropes too long. Mine are all cut at 10, 10 and a half foot. They kind of, it's kind of long this is. Yeah, our, our, I find they're much better than the size we have. Right, so I'm talking to you. That's neutral now. She should not come forward in into me, unrequested forward motion. She should not do that until I ask. Because I've set her where she is, she should stay. Every time she comes forward, I love it because I back them up twice as far as they came. In the end, they wait on us. Try to get her attention. Right, now I'm not neutral. Now I'm, that's forward motion. I'm gone. And that's how we do the stop. Back up two. One, two. Thank you. Now go. Go. There. Stop. Back up. See, so, yeah, I tighten up. No notice. Absolutely. That didn't do anything for her. There. Nah. Now she's gone. Right. Okay. So now, come on. And it's important because this could be the where she gets funny with the trailer that I take absolutely no, no notice of this till she Absolutely no notice. <sighs> Tell her how good she is. Now that kind of behaviour is almost welcomed for me because you get through 
you get through the emotions and they re realize now I'm going to do it from the other side now now disengage back up I'm going to try and not move much now so she starts to realize I'm moving her feet she's not moving mine so can she go this way now disengage her back her up thank you go this way There's the trailer loading. Disengage. You've never used a flag ever. This might be fun. No, this shouldn't shouldn't bother her if I'm not looking at her. And this is how you start this off. Get them used to flapping stuff. She's already getting a bit more used to this. It's a real good thing if you can get your horses really used to these flags. Now, she see her settling? Now she's got to know she can get rid of this by feet forward for me. So I'm going totally now from, from me not looking at her, not meaning anything. Now, I want a foot forward. Now the flag's gone. This is how you start this. Stop. Now it shouldn't mean anything. Because I'm not looking at her. I'm neutral. No, I'm not. Now the flag's gone. Stop. No, I'm gone. She's getting to love the top. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Lovely. So I've got straight, I'm not moving. She said that's supposed to frighten me. Yeah, good. Do you want to take her over here again now? Yeah. There's not much more you can do, really. Not bad, because you were in the thing, nearly. Whee! That's brilliant. Oh. I think it's going to be a, a good... Once that floor's done. She's been in a couple of times, lovely. She was pushing past Michelle a bit. That's why I'm saying do this because it was kind of like worked out she could push past her to come out. Yeah. Um, yeah she didn't do with me. Yeah. But we need a clip. Yeah. That's fine. We'll we'll put a clip on. I'll bring a couple of clips next time when you've had that ramp done. Because when we do shut up, we'll put the clip. If she panics, the clip it'll slide out so she won't get damaged. But I think I think it's, I think it's gonna be fine. I don't think she's gonna panic out there at all. I, really, I think she's been in that often now and she weren't bothered about all she was doing was pushing through Michelle a little bit not in a panic but just just you know what I mean she didn't do it with me no um, she's a big horse big horse yeah big horse to have pushing he looks like Jock at a lady in the tramp is, that the, is she the biggest horse here uh, yeah so guys 
this is the was Cara. Yeah, um, the the cub that we did, the youngster. Yeah. And things have gone a lot better. Yeah. Uh, really, really good yeah. since the last. Yeah. You've been getting the bit in. Yeah. You're kind of working that out. Yeah. She's um, really, really, happy. really. Really. When you really now she's got a habit of standing that corner, which is fine. You said she's always done that. But you catch her differently now. Yeah. She kind you wait for her to come to you. Um, so the bit in is good. The siding up. siding up's good. Siding up lovely. Really siding up lovely. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm leaning over. Oh wow. So uh, things have gone really well the last three weeks. You seem really pleased with everything. I don't really know how I can help you. She hasn't had an explosion with me out there, but I've only been out there twice. Right. She's been fabulous in here. So How do you think she'll be with that? Uh... Top. I think she'll probably freak. I think you might be right. Yeah. Uh, we don't. We don't want to. We don't want to ruin. For going forward, we don't want to go right backwards. Is there any reason she shouldn't be able to cope with that? Probably not. Probably not. So it's your decision. I think as a three-year-old and what you're doing, you're doing it absolutely right. Have you took her for, for walks and stuff? No. That's something she's gone. really reactive. Come out of the gate and she's like, head up, snorting, go a little bit further down the lane and she's... So you don't feel reactive. confident to take her for a walk? No. See, get her out see that, the that, that, see, all our youngsters yeah. now, we've got a two-year-old and a three-year-old. They're all, we took them out in the trailers, we've took them out down fields, we've showed them the cows, we've took them... Yeah, you know, we get them out. We get so really. If you want to have a future and you want to be going to shows and things, would you agree? You should be able to walk your horse down here at three. Yeah, so okay, that's something. You don't have to leave the yard. We, yeah, but you should be able to go and show the village. Yeah. Would you? It's not out of the question, is it, to do that? To, yeah. So, to would you there. want me to do that with you? We'll have a walk down there. Yeah. Uh, we'll do that first before we have. And then I think if we go up there, I'll do a bit of groundwork yeah. and then we'll do the tarp and then get you to walk around, do a few stops oh, and things. Exactly. How's that sound? Perfect. Yeah, because the other stuff, I think you're just going to have to go quietly, how you are, build on it. Um, so where's my, we'll use my, you know what, which one's that? As soon as I see this, right? Yeah. And I want to say, here's Johnny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah Johnny's home. Yeah. Yes, little rub, little rub. Oh, that's totally in a different world, oh, yeah. isn't it? Good timing. She turned for you. Oh, coming in really nicely. It will be a great thing. So, how did you do that? That up. Let's just have a look at Probably that. Wrong. Can we just look? Yeah. Can you have a look at this time? Yeah. Look, there's no right or wrong. Right? Some people do that and get away with it. I don't because sometimes I have horses pull hard on me, uh, so that would tighten more. So this look. Yeah. Tuck it under there, go up with your thumb, and then this goes round and back through. Look, see, the, so so that the knot is over the loop. Can I show you that again? Yeah. You went up here. Yeah, I went. Yeah, with this, remember with the, with all the bridling, try and get you used to being here with us. Yeah. No, I'm just saying about the bridling. All right, yeah. You, you want to try and get her used to being here with us for the eventual bridling. As you pulled away there. I've just asked us again. So that goes round and back through over the loop. Yeah. You were up here with it. I was, yeah. I'll just show you again. So again, any opportunity to get a bending towards it. You went over here. Yeah, there you're going. All right. I find it tightens too much. So again, a little, t so up, up, ask her to come this way. And then through there, see? I always say it's like making a deal. See that? Do you think you can do it that way? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Tell her how good she is. Look at that girl. Definitely a softer look in her eye. Uh, so you've been doing very well. So, rather than get away from you, there's less chance of getting away from me. We'll we'll walk down and we'll see. Okay. <laughs> and this is a horse, guys, that hasn't been down here without exploding. So now we rub on her, All right, okay? So you cut. You're gonna. You're not gonna just go and. You're gonna be in a panic. We're gonna go so far. Let her know everything's good. I was there. Uh, um, no, doesn't hurt sometimes to come back anyway. 
So we'll come back, let the car go. So I would do exactly what I'm doing in your first few times out here. So we come as far as the gate. And I just back her up a little bit because she pushed on me a little bit. Tell her how good she is. Tell her how good she is. Fine. Fine. Okay. It's their natural thing too. So I might stop her here. Uh, get her attention. Tell her how good she is. Okay, nice. No, just to, just do it in in increment. No, that was unrequested forward motion. So she went to go through me there. I've just said she'll feel better with me if I don't allow that, see? So I'm a parent to her. She can trust me more. So I just bumped her back then because she went to walk through me. That makes sense? If there's any explosion, I want it to happen while it's with me. So you know. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely feel. Horse, this horse has never been down here, guys. Um, um, it'd be, and what I might do is crack the mouth here. What you could do as well, if the mouth's tight, just cr put your fingers in and crack it like it, it, it tan. It really helps. If she starts getting tight, you'll know. She'll start breathing funny. Just as we said before, loosen the mouth off. Start to relax. Look at that. Hey, no, uh, 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 no, I'm going to back her up a little bit here away from me. Um, and then she's getting a little bit tense. So I'm going to crack her mouth. She's heard a dog or something there. So I'll just wait for a second. There, she breathed out. We'll go a bit further. This is quite a big deal for her, really. Now, maybe if you can get involved with me as well and come and start rubbing on her with me. So she's got support of two people. Um, she's really worried here because look at her feet stands. But we'll just tell her how good she is. That's it. How brilliant is this? She's actually handling this well. She's come a long way, ain't she, the last... But... Right. That's the drain. Drain. Would you agree? You go, girl. Go. Hmm? So again, if you, if you notice what I'm going to do, a little bit tense. Yeah, yeah. just. Drop her head uh, uh, her you, do you know what? You could, you could a little bit, yes, yeah. especially down the bottom. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. There you go. Let's go again. Where? Well, don't, don't make me think about that. No, sorry. Not really. Because they've got plenty of room to get round on a loose rope. I'd be more worried if one was going to shove me in there. Do you know what I mean? If you got them by a tight... Oh, I think she's handling this great on her own. We could cheat her into this and bring three horses with her, but that's not, well, we could, yeah. that's not, you know, we get used, used to this. And the stimulation she's getting, isn't it? Maybe a First time, girl. Maybe a, a little dog down here, 
Yeah. 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 For, I wouldn't be asking you to come this far to start with. Get really used to all of this. To about here, I would say. First time, not even this far. But I'm going to just show the traffic. This is, you know, what I'd be doing. Really get used to being down here. I would maybe bring a... I would put a bucket of bananas, if she loves bananas, she there. Loves bananas. I would put them down in there. Yeah. When you get down here, when she gets here... I'd, I'd spend I'd spend half an hour here, half see? Yeah. They'll have some bananas. Yeah. Unrequested. Forward motion. She was yeah. gonna come through here. She with me she'll yeah. she'll she'll trust me more for don't allow yeah. that that makes sense it does. It makes yeah, sense. yeah. Uh, let her have a little look around no unrequested towards me i'm on it so we'll crack her mouth here there tell her how good she is now we almost don't we don't we don't worry about her too much if she thinks no 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 yeah, look she's... look yeah, really yeah, that's now. all right. That's all right. Uh, so, oh, it's a dog she's looking at there. where? Yeah, where's the dog? It's gone into. Oh the yeah, that's all right. Yeah. So, the more she realizes she can't push even here where she's worried, mm -hmm. the more I say, the more she'll relax with me. But this is brilliant. Yeah, yeah. The stimulation, the stimulation. Looking around. She's better than you thought she'd be. She's not a sweaty mess, is she? Loads better than I thought she would wow. be, to be honest. Loads, but I didn't yeah. get her down here. <laughs> and honestly, yeah, well, I thought she'd freak out. I wasn't sure either. No, she's not so apt to run through here now. No. She would have. You see a lot of people holding them and they're pushing them around. The horse goes to pieces because it knows it can. Because it, you know. Um, but yeah, I'm just waiting for a nice little relax here. Yeah. She's already relaxing. She's, yeah, but she's going to be. But I wouldn't look at her too much. No, no. This is what I was about to say. If we keep looking at, yeah, but if if we look at them to think how they are, they they kind of pick up on that. Oh, how am I supposed to be? How am I supposed? Back up a, a step, thank you. Tell her how good she is. She just look at this. She's looking around, thinking, "Wow, what is this? Is the world? Yeah. Look at the. Tell you what." Look at that lovely horse she got. Beautiful. She is beautiful. Look at that. I've had moments of despair over the last Well, don't we all? Thinking, I'm like, what have I done? <laughs> am I ever going to be able to take this approach? Am I ever going to be good <laughs> hey, enough? Hey, kid. Now she's relaxing. Yeah. This is why we don't leave here till she's relaxed. Yeah. So you'll always remember that, see? She's just, this is stimulation. How stimulated is she? She's looking around, she's seeing things. The different smells down here. Stimulation. Fabulous. Fabulous. Now, what I've got to make sure is going back. She doesn't rush back. Because if we nip it in the bud, you know you get a horse that rush back to stay when you're riding them. This is where it has to be put right before you allow that. Because she'll realize the, the, the bit is a bluff and just keep like, there. There's the point. Did you see the point? So that's where we would think about heading back. But she can't rush past me. She has to come up quietly. Um, look at that. There you go. There you look at this. Look at this. Right, let's go. So, so we'll go back now. Yeah. She knows we're going back now. Quiet. I haven't got a death grip on her, have I? Come on then. They're usually pretty good at knowing what not to eat. Parsley. That wasn't that gone off parsley. Right, let's all fuss on her then. All fuss on her. Tell her how great she is. She's in good hands. 
Her breathing's lovely. Look at that, loose mouth on her own. That's it. <laughs> Try and do your first trip when it's a nice day. Yeah. Right? Because yeah. that's in our favour at the moment. It's got it's a little breeze. Nice. I'm here. She's good. She backed up. That's good. She can't be bothered. Huh? Would she eat a bit of that grass? Or have they, have they got a lot of grass? Private anyway. Isn't it? See if she wants a little bit of uh, grass. <laughs> So I'm just going to hold. She don't want to go back. And it's all your demonstrating how positively serious can be for her. Yeah. yeah. But you've got to have a certain amount of leadership. She can't push, if she pushed through me twice down there, where well, I had to back her up, she would have not been this calm. And that, you know, it's a, all horsemanship is, is observe, remember and compare. The observe is what you're doing now. You gotta remember it, where you're gonna have a video and you, you've got a certain memory yourself. It's the comparing where most people fall down and it's not their fault. I've compared this on thousands of horses. I know I've allowed horses to push through me a bit, it didn't work. She's actually very put. She, she's very sound of mind, isn't she? Yeah. She's probably more confident than you think. It's yeah. She's not a novice horse. We, you know that. She's not for a novice person. It's you got to kind of be a little bit on top. Really <laughs> <laughs> well, how about me? I'm the granddaddy. Well, I think that's a good spot to go. Okay. Well, what a beautiful experience. First time off the farm. Down by the village. Really good. And she's following me back. Not rushing home. And that would, you see, if she did, that would transfer to being a barn sour horse. We just went down the village. <laughs> Whoa. If you jump out the way, I'm going to see if I can get a forward step. Disengage your hind end. Go that way. There's your trailer. Yeah. I wouldn't know. You don't need to overdo this. I wouldn't mind you just taking her over there. All right, it might not be as polished. <laughs> this is a nice hour for a really, isn't it? Straight over. Good. Be aware in your peripheral vision where she is. Good, good, really good. Just look at her feet. Good. I mean, she's up here on her own. It's really good, isn't it? You know, I think that's brilliant. Um, all right, I think, I think, 
I think that's okay. Yeah. I do. I do. Yeah. Dif different pony. Yeah. I think so now. Look at that. Coming out nice from the loose loose rain, look. I think, you know, every couple of months you might want me to pop up for a, for, for a, you know, a session really. Every couple of months. Yeah. See how you're getting on, see if there's anything you need help with. Yeah. So, another job well done, Mr. Young. Yeah, well, we've got to go back. And guess what? Way. It is lunchtime. And do you remember when we used to come down here? This is Salva Harbour. Will I get? Beer garden. What are you thinking? A pint and a baguette or something? Uh, oh. Do you know what? I love you. Uh, <laughs> yeah, look. Uh, is the water in? No. Oh, it's out. It's out. This is where Dan uh, Dan uses that slipway for our for our boat time. Go around again and try. Tanya's ordering our couple of drinks and a jacket and I've seen this. I had to come and have a look at it guys. I'm not sure what year it is. I love these old cars. I love them. I know there's people watching this that will know what this is. Yeah, they might say it. I don't know what that emblem is, I will find out. Yeah. Lovely, look at that. Just a light lunch because we've been taken to dinner tonight, aren't we? Oh, Charlotte's ringing. Oh, look at that. I'll ring Born it back. Rose sauce. Beautiful salad. Oh, lovely. And I've got Maybe a cheese and onion baguette. And, and of course. <laughs> lovely job. Fed and watered. Uh, yes, that was a nice little uh, little munches, wasn't it? Mine was okay. Till tonight. Yeah. Till tonight. Being took out for my birthday. Yeah. Julie, our friend. Julie and Nigel. Guess what I'm going to have? Uh, does it begin with D? Yeah. Does duck, it go, does it go duck quack, quack? In, yeah, duck in orange sauce. The best. Oh, look, it's in now. Oi. We wouldn't be able to ride on the surface. So a good surfer. That's what Dan used to, well, he is, isn't he? He's, Dan's a great surfer. So that was two horses in one, in one visit. I try not to do that too often these days, but uh, with the ramp going, that, that was scary, that ramp, guys. Like, like I said in the video, I have seen it where they've gone through. Uh, it's quite an old trailer, really well built trailer, but obviously that ramp's gone, gone, started to go rotten now. Needs replacing now, I wasn't willing to keep going because if it had happened further up, you can get into trouble. Horse won't trust you then, you build a trust up and when you lose that trust, uh, then it's hard to get back. And if a horse goes through with its foot, it's really difficult to get them going up that ramp then. Uh, so, uh, uh, we got a chance then to work the other horse. That horse had never been off off the yard, guys. Well, how brilliant now for for that horse to to sort of move on in life now, uh, and um, her owner's going to keep taking her out for walks. I know she started doing that. Change change that. It give the, the horse more confidence. A little bit of a tricky moment when that horse jumped over. You know, it's in a split second, isn't it? You know, the way that the horses shows how powerful they are. But all in all, great visit. I'm going back. I will put a little video on. I'm going back. The ramp, I think, has gone in for repair now. So in a couple of weeks' time, because we're off to Scotland, we're packing in the morning. We're off to Scotland. Uh, we're going to be in Scotland for a few days. Uh, get back. And then I think we've got a 1,300-mile round trip then. I think there's five horses that are booked in. Uh, sort of going on around Reekin. Some really, really um, lost horses that we're going to. And it'd be interesting to get some videos of those. Hopefully all that will work out all right for me. Uh, yeah, and that's it. I'll put it, like I say, when I go back, 
and do that horse that has got a tendency to rush out and uh, that's why we've got to get that right i think it'll work out good so that'll go on i'll put that on uh and i think that's about it i think i better get some sleep now and uh yeah it's been a good day today as well because we've had uh we've had a, a visitor uh for the last couple of days um mary her name is she's come all the way down guys from uh near the isle of sky i can't remember the exact little island she's on but it's near the isle of sky uh, they can see the northern lights up there. She's travelled down and had a couple of days just just learning some of what she's seen on the videos. And uh, she's had a real good couple of days. We've gone through a lot of questions and just helped her a little bit. Um, well, she said a lot, but you know, as long as we can help a little bit on these visits. So she stayed in the shepherd's hut. I asked her, how did you sleep? She said, I've never slept so well. So, you know, all in all, a good couple of days. We'll get up to Scotland get a good demo done up there and then get back and carry on. So, um, so that's it guys. Uh, share, like, uh, comment, please uh, uh, get us all, uh, keep on, uh, on that road, um, of building because the channel, James says our channel's building, everything's going, going great guys. So thanks for that. And yeah, happy trails. Tanya snoring her head off up there. <laughs> so, uh, Tanya won't comment today, but uh, yeah, Happy trials, guys. Second time. Cheers.